Yo, 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 it is Quan Rabbit here, and I'm answering your guys' question. I'm answering Bunny Nation's questions. Questions you've always wanted to ask me, I'm here to answer them. Let's go. Our first question from Walmart Bruno Mars. <laughs> dream collab. Oh, man, I couldn't tell you who my dream collab is. It's just so many. Uh, I would really want to collab with Big Sean. Big Sean is a big inspiration to me there's some like obvious answers like you know collab with nf or collab with eminem or collab with jay-z you know i think big sean and i could make a great song a banger something that drops a lot of gems you know and just really motivate people you know all right next question what are your goals for 2023 and where would you like to see yourself in five years that's a great question. Where I would like to see myself in five years, hopefully a full-time paid artist, rapper, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> I just really, really, really want to succeed in what I do. You know, show my kids that, you know, anything is possible, no matter how big you dream it, how impossible it seems. Because guess what? Somebody had to be something at one point, you know, the very first thing that they became. And my goals for 2023 is just really drop as much music as I can, but make it quality, you know? So I'm gonna try to balance the both, really, really, really try to balance quality and quantity because I feel like 2021 and 2022, I was just more putting out quantity. Not saying that the songs aren't quality, but I, I was more in a state of I got to get these songs out, you know? Next question from TC22. When are you getting a girlfriend? Oh, that's a great question. Uh, I don't know, man. It's, it's whenever the right one comes along, whether if it's, you know, someone I find on tour, if I ever tour, uh, or if it's someone I happen to bump into at Target. I don't know. It, it's whenever it happens. Next question. Why is Quan Rabbit from Cushmaster Way? That's a great question. Why is Quan Rabbit? I don't know. You tell me. Uh, Quan Rabbit is uh, Quan Rabbit is is that exactly? <laughs> Next question. What inspired you to start making music, and what are your goals for this year? Uh, so, what inspired me to make music was really. I never really wanted to be a musician. I wanted to be many other things before I decided to be a rapper. I wanted to be a detective. I wanted to be a baseball player. I wanted to be a singer at one point. So I, I guess I, I guess you know I did want to be a musician. But the thing is with that is I don't know. It, it's just one of those things where it's like I know I couldn't sing, but I always wanted to be because I love singing, and I think. I think everything that I wanted to be kind of tied into being wanting to be a rapper. I still got the music part in. I still have a, I also wanted to be a guidance counselor or a counselor of sort, you know, just helping people out uh, with their problems because I went through problems when I was younger, as you clearly, clearly know, but I just wanted to help others, you know? So helping others through music, uh, the detective side kind of still is there, you know, figuring out words and rhymes and how to put them together and stuff. Then you also have the, you know, the baseball player. Like maybe I'm not a, a player, but I still get to perform in front of others, you know, when I do perform. <laughs> I can do everything that I wanted to do with this, you know, choice. And goals for this year, you know, I have already answered. Uh, next question is from beans gaming 7353 what made you start rapping what made me start rapping was i was bored <laughs> and i wanted to see what i could do because i was always impressed from like you know the songs that i heard so i was like oh maybe let me give it a try you know that's really what it is i feel like that's like that for a lot of people like they just want to give it a try and then uh know my name was actually the first beat i ever wrote to you know so <laughs> yeah you know that, that was a full circle moment for me you know when i actually did put out know my name uh the first like eight bars first lines eight lines of the song were my original first lyrics ever written i wanted to keep that so i could always remember where i came from 
Next question. Poopity scoop, scoopity whoop, poopity scoop. Facts. <laughs> Next question. What's your favorite movie? That's a great question. My favorite movie really, uh, it changes a lot. Like, I'm a big superhero nerd. So I really, really love uh, The Dark Knight. You know, might be a basic pick, but The Dark Knight, really the whole trilogy as a whole. Same thing with the original Sam Raimi Spider-Man movies. Love those. Uh, Logan is up there. Fantastic movie. Uh, the Lego movie is just something I've, I think I've watched more than anything else, you know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the, the Lego movie's up there. Uh, I, I really can't pick one. Uh, maybe Endgame, Infinity War. I feel like these are like basic picks though. I don't know. Uh, there's a lot of great movies, a lot of good movies. That even outside of the superhero genre. You got Interstellar. You got Inception, which I know are both Christopher Nolan films. Uh, the Grey was a, a movie that really like stuck with me for like the longest time. Yeah, you know, there's I love Liam Neeson movies. The John Wick trilogy is amazing. Uh, oh man, it's really hard to just pick one. I hope, I hope hopefully I answered your question. Next we got our next question from Virginia. Uh, what made you start music? How do you process everything mentally when releasing new music? Who is your dream collab, independent and label artist? That's a great question. So I already answered why I started music, but how do I process everything mentally when releasing new music? That's really, I don't, I really don't. I, I, I just, most times I just try to go with the flow. Before I used to always like be so crazy and like, ah, I gotta, you know, like, I gotta release a song, I gotta make it right, I, mean, I gotta make sure, you know, people know about it, etc. Just go with the flow, you know, I release it. I try to study up as much marketing as I can to make sure that it gets promoted the right way, the way it should be. Uh, it depends on the song too. You know, I just really get excited for you guys to hear the new music, you know. And then my dream collab, independently and label-wise, independently would probably have to be either Hobson or Tech 9 you know, even Russ, I think is a good uh, uh, pick. And then label wise, uh, I always wanna work with singers, you know what I mean? I always wanna work with uh, Demi Lovato, that's another good, great pick. I wanna work with uh, Rihanna, I think would be dope. But like rapping wise, I would probably pick, as much as y'all probably gonna clown me, but like MGK, I think he's a dope rapper, you know? I think we have like that same style, same energy. Denzel Curry, I don't know if he's a label or independent, but I would love to work with him. Hopefully those are good picks and hopefully one day they, they happen, you know? But next question is, how much money has this career made you? Have you been careful with that money? Is it all accounted for? Or do you think maybe some of it has been misplaced? Like how the US government misplaced trillions of dollars shortly before 9-11. <laughs> that is a fantastic question. Uh, I've probably made about like $1,500, you know, not nothing crazy, but, uh, and careful with that money. I haven't spent it on anything stupid. Like I, you know, I, I've spent it, you know, on gas for my car, you know, or I've spent it on food to eat. You know, I think that's careful. Um, is it all accounted for? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, maybe I trust my, DSP uh, a little uh, too much, but you know, or do you think so? I don't know, man. The the nine eleven question. That oh, hopefully I don't get flagged, but I'm gonna I'm gonna leave that uh, unknown. <laughs> Next question: How much do you enjoy rapping primarily on YouTube? Like how the primary defense system against plane hijackings of North American Aerospace Defense Command was told to stand down during 9-11. What were they? Another great question. Holy crap. Uh, I do enjoy rapping on YouTube, which is a great thing. I would love to do more on YouTube, but I feel like I don't want to overshadow my original music. Like I would love to do more remix remixes. I would love to do, but 
I don't want to just release like covers. I want to actually like perform my videos, like even if it's like a lip sync music video type of thing. But you know, I also want to try to keep it like professional as possible. You know, because I always want to deliver a high quality, and I just want like fans to always feel like you know that's that dude. You know, he comes with the work. You know, uh, everything else after that uh, is a great question. Uh, where were they? That's a great question. Where were they? Where were they? What were they doing? Why? You know, <laughs> uh, who is your inspiration? I have two inspirations and they're both my daughters, uh, Melanie and Amari, my angels, my beautiful girls. Uh, my mother is another inspiration. Uh, she never got to live the life that she really wanted to live. Uh, so I want to be able to show her that her son has, her son did live the life that he wanted to do, you know, live. Family and friends are also inspiration, but also like passion, passion for rap, passion for hip hop, <clears throat> but also vengeance at the same time. Uh, not to be so like Debbie Downer, but like, you know, a lot of people doubted me. You know, a lot of people didn't believe me. A lot of people still don't believe me. They don't care. You know, a lot of people don't want to see me succeed. They want to just laugh in my face. And so it's like, you know, venge vengeance is another thing. It's like 50-50, passion and vengeance, you know, uh, is what keeps me going. Because, you know, fuck them. <laughs> uh, and last question. <clears throat> when are we getting that album? Man, I don't know. I'm really, I'm trying to work as hard as I can on it. Uh, album's mostly written out. You know, uh, there's just a lot of other things that, you know, come into play. We got, uh, album, you know, beat purchases. We got studio recording. We got mixes. We got mastering. Uh, there's a lot that goes into the album. Then I got to think of content, music videos, et cetera, et cetera. But I, what I can tell you is my first song is going to be sacrifice featuring crypt and hopefully you guys tune in uh i don't know if it'll be ready and out for pre-save by then but that's my next song that's the lead single off the album hopefully you guys tune in trust me because this one you do not want to miss but hopefully i answered all you guys question hopefully you like this be sure to leave a like share it with your friends share it with other quan rabbit fans I'll see you in the next video more to come, Bunny Nation. Peace out.